What's going on? Kyle Russ here with Hydro Mind. Um, we're talking about mind surfing, the science of mind surfing. So really what that is, is visualization and how you can actually use it to accelerate your progress as a surfer. So right now I'm upstairs, I'm here hiding in the nursery for the new baby. We don't use this room right now, so it's a madhouse downstairs. Everyone's on lockdown, so we're going crazy. So mind surfing, visualization, this is an important technique any time of the year, but especially on lockdown, it's a great way to kind of keep your nerves sharp and keep you sort of mentally in the game. So when we get back out there, you it won't be such a hard hit. So you gotta keep your fitness in order, you gotta keep your mind in order. So mind surfing, super powerful technique. So right now in this video, I'm gonna just tell you how to properly do um, mind surfing visualization techniques and a few examples of people you've heard of who use it to be ultra successful. So a couple quick, pointers to do visualization correctly. For me, I make these video breakdowns of pro surfers, the best surfers, because you want to take the example from the best surfers, right? Why not go straight to the top? When I was a kid, um, I used to play tons of basketball and I spent hours and hours shooting out in the driveway and I didn't have, there, there was no internet back then or no YouTube or whatever. And so I would have basketball cards, just single pictures of Michael Jordan. I'd look at those pictures and I'd study them. The way he'd hold his hands, but his hands were way bigger than mine, so I couldn't hold the ball quite the same. But the way he put his arm and his elbow and his legs changed everything for me. So I just copied Michael Jordan from one single picture, changed the way I played basketball, and my shot uh, was, I don't know, I was pretty proud of my shot back then. So, I, But put a lot of practice copying the best in the world. So that's why it's important to go straight to the top. So with surfing, I do the same thing. Um, but then as I got older, when videos started coming out, if skateboarding was a big one because I would spend a lot of time rewinding videos like to learn kickflips, how exactly they did it. And there weren't a lot of surfing videos up um, where I was growing up in Canada, but now that I'm older, um, I'm definitely more into the mind surfing for, or the video <laughs> breakdown for surfing. So the best way to do it, go straight to the top and you want to visualize it as detailed as possible. So these slow motion videos I make, it gets into all the details. So you can picture yourself doing it. And the important part about picturing yourself doing it, you have to attach emotion to it. So you got the visualization, you got to attach the emotion because it makes it real in your nervous system and it really rewires your brain like you've already done it. So joy and um, the ple pleasure emotions are really, really, really make it real for you. And without that, it doesn't get wired into you as hard. So the important part about that, when it's inside you, like you've already done it neurologically, when you get into the water, it's not like a guessing game. It's not like, oh, I've never been here. What do I do? All that kind of stuff. So if you visualize yourself moving your body the right way, your upper body, your lower body, what sequence, what part of the wave, the timing, all that stuff, it, it can go miles and miles and miles ahead um, of your progress. And even for me now, like when I'm in the water and the pros are in the water, you can bet I'm watching exactly what they're doing, where they're sitting, all that kind of stuff. So it's really, really important to take inspiration of those that come before you and those that are better than you. If you think about it, if you had to reinvent everything, so I get pushed back on that, just people are like, ah, it doesn't work, ah, this and that. But if we were to have to invent everything ourselves, we would have to start from scratch. Everything would like stand on the shoulders of giants, right? So like we have the best surfboards, the best designs, because everyone has been doing it for decades now. And got these best surfers that have the best coaches that do it, practice, have these thousands of hours performing them. That's who we're gonna go to for inspiration, right? So it's super smart to do it. And someone you may have heard of, Kelly Slater, he had a great example I heard him telling a story about him doing it. So about attaching that positive emotion. So. He was saying, I think it was before surfing in the finals at Pipe, or doesn't matter. So what he would do when he would be walking out on the beach, he would picture that all over the beach there was the word no. And he, in his mind, he would turn all those words to yes, to yes, to yes. So all these no's are going to yeses. And it became this super positive thing where he has this positive, awesome emotion. So it gets him in the mindset of winning and being positive and believing that he can do it. And so that's how real or important attaching that positive emotion is to these things. And another guy, uh, Kobe Bryant, uh, Shaquille O'Neal would tell this story where he would come into the gym and Kobe would already be there practicing and he's out there shooting and jumping around running like he got in all the tents, but he had no ball. He did what he was pretending to play basketball. Shaq's like, what is this guy doing? He's so weird, but he's, he's making it real in his mind. So when he gets there and he has the ball, and it's at the buzzer and he's taking the game winning shot, he's been there a thousand times already and he's already prepared for it. So super important stuff. Um, so I made a entire library of all these different things, all the maneuvers. So what's changed from when I was a kid and I was just looking at one single image of Michael Jordan or rewinding uh, VHS tapes 
to see how people do things. Technology has changed. So there's still visualization still, still works. It just makes it so much easier because we have better technology. We have digital videos, we have slow motion, we have instant access to all of this kind of stuff. So I made this library of all these different things. I've learned so much making them. It takes a lot of time for me. It takes hours of study and video editing and uploading and all that stuff. But what's great for you is you can just go in there and look at them all because I have them in video library. So you can look what kind of maneuver you're working on, what you want to learn. You can select the pro video that um, I've broken down already. And you can really accelerate performance. Um, and so if you are into that, I'll give you a free trial of it. You can get in there now. You can watch all the free videos. So it's in my Hydromind U membership platform. So you get all the pro breakdowns, the library of it. If there's something in there that you want to see that you don't see, suggest it to me and there's a very good chance I'll make it because I love making them and I've learned so much from doing it. So if there's something you see in there that, or that you would like to see a specific wave, a specific surfer, a specific move, any of that, let me know. Good chance I'll make it. And so you can try it all for free. It's included with that, with Hydro Mind You, you'll have uh, the weaponized breath, breath training system, it's something called Surf 101, which is all like pop-up paddling technique um, and a bunch of other stuff like that, duck diving and then a whole workout library, nutritional advice, so it's everything you need to rock it, including the pro breakdown. So you got the body, you got the breath, you got the mind, everything you need to rock it surfing, especially when we're on lockdown. So when you get out of this lockdown, you'll hit the ground running, you'll be surfing better than ever. So that's something you want, check it out. It's absolutely a free trial, so you can see it all, try them all, do the mind surfing techniques, make it real in your mind, take it to the water, and surf better than you ever have in your life. So there'll be a link around here somewhere for you to get your free trial. Um, up until Sunday, I'll be offering it. So get it while it's hot. My name is Kyle Ross with Hydro Mind. Thanks for watching.